Well, as far as I can tell, the government just continuing to faff around, basically, when it comes to the ECHR, talking about maybe leaving sometime in the future. Well, big whoop. The reality is of what's happened in 2023, we've had more tough speeches about what the government are going to do. This is the reality of what is going on already. Over 2,000 people crossing from France on small boats in 2023. Uh, 890 people, 20 boats in February 2023 alone. We know, of course, that Sir Weller Braveman, the Home Secretary, has said very clearly we need to leave ECHR to stop the boats. I've seen firsthand, as I say, I've been in court fighting these cases for several years uh, and I've seen what's happened with the Rwanda flight and the Rwanda policy. The reality is that the policy is vulnerable uh, to claims based on Human Rights Act uh, or the European Convention, namely Article 3 claims and Article 8 rights. Uh, and, uh, and we will simply not be able to uh, remove in significant numbers uh, those people coming across the channel illegally in risky circumstances unless we uh, eliminate those kinds of claims against our actions. And that's why we do need to leave the European Convention on Human Rights. I just think it's crazy, isn't it, that you've got a Home Secretary who's openly said that and yet the government's policy still going nowhere near that apart from talking about, oh, well, we may do that in the future sometime. That's what the government are actually going to do. Well, we hear now that channel migrants could be barred from using the Human Rights Act as the government goes over its plans and that those who enter the UK illegally could be barred from using the Human Rights Act under these proposed new laws being considered by the Home Secretary. Now, we know Braven wants to take uh, tough action on this, uh, powers potentially to disapply the Human Rights Act in these cases, but look at that, it would still mean they could take their cases to Strasbourg. You've got a Home Office source there quoted by The Telegraph as saying, the report makes a strong case for measures to ensure the new legislation stops the boats. Suella backs a lot of the ideas in this report and wants the toughest possible legislation so that we meaningfully tackle illegal migration across the channel. Illegal migrants, they say, must be detained and swiftly removed once they've arrived on our shores. But under these proposals, you see here, Britain would remain in ECHR. This would all still be considered, these cases, by the European Court. Frankly, I don't think that's good enough. And I think if they go ahead with that, the Tories will lose the next election. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below on that potential plan, guys, if you have any faith in this government or not. I will keep bringing you the very latest, so please do whack this video a quick thumbs up. And of course, as ever, cheers for watching.